Are your fields of play turning prospective students away? Are your hard courts cracked, pool when it rains, and generally unsafe for use? Are your natural turf fields void of actual grass and are instead replaced with clumps of weeds or large patches of compacted earth? The following Sport Edge designed fields of play not only provide a safe place for students to be active, they've also proved they can become the jewel in the crown for an education facility by raising interest and attracting future students. Joint use agreements between local governments and schools can help to unlock additional funding streams for your facility. When completed, the Greensboro High School facility will deliver a FIFA quality synthetic pitch and a large natural turf tablet for multi-sport co-use. These fields of play will both be used by the school and local community sporting teams. The Glen Eagles High School FIFA compliant synthetic pitch was also delivered for the purpose of a joint use agreement. It will enable the facility for community use outside of school hours. The following Netball Courts projects were funded by state government and supported by Netball Victoria. The driver was to deliver compliant Netball Courts within inner Melbourne municipalities to address the increase in participation in the sport. Developing on school sites under joint use agreements removed the need to use public spaces and upgraded school non-compliant facilities. It also ensured a high level of use for the developed courts. The design of these courts didn't come without challenges. Most were developed in the northern suburbs of Melbourne, which consist of highly reactive soils. These reactive soils need to be accounted for in the design, as it will ensure there is no movement of the court surface in years to come. The Melbourne Girls College project actually retained the existing pavement as a sub-base to the overlying new pavement. This choice has been made as this helps reduce disposal costs and increase construction productivity. Like so many landlocked schools in developed locations, the Ivanhoe Grammar School didn't have the ability to expand school facilities. To address school drop-off and pickups, as well as staff parking, SportEng helped the school develop natural turf field above the underground car park. Blackburn High School is another great example of delivering high quality facilities for schools. Here, the multi-use acrylic hard courts are covered without having to develop large fully enclosed buildings. With the climate only getting hotter, these types of facilities are becoming more commonplace and help ensure that children can still be active outdoors whether it is hot or wet. The shelter provided to this end covered two acrylic multi-use courts. Prior to their redevelopment, Peninsula Grammar School's asphalt courts were tired, cracked and unsafe for use. The redeveloped courts consisted of sport governing body compliant multi-use courts, general use areas as well as concrete terraced seating. Being centrally located within the school, parents have continually commented on how this facility now provides a great space for children to play and have fun. Consisting of a World Athletics compliant athletics track with a FIFA standard synthetic pitch infield, an MCG sized natural turf oval and synthetic grass baseball facility, the Deakin University Warren Ponds campus sports facility boasts one of the most remarkable facilities within Australia. The La Trobe University facility is also impressive. The natural turf oval and FIFA compliant synthetic pitch services not only the university and community sporting club needs, but also supports elite teams as a training base. So if you are interested in developing high quality, fit for purpose fields of play and investing in the future, please speak to our team on how we can assist with making your facilities into assets for growth.